Okay, apartment 233. Got it. I'll meet you fellas there in a bit. How about it? See you later. What's up guys, it's me Chris here, and today I have a preview for you of the upcoming game Mafia 2. Now this game comes out in a matter of days, so it's probably just in time to tell you whether or not it's worth the pre-order. Now, as you can see, before I start anything else, the environments in this game are amazing. You can just pop open the fridge, crack a bottle of coke, and just guzzle it down right then and there. You can also just go pick up the phone, turn on the TV, and really just the, in, the interactivity in the environments is great. Now, also, I will say, this game will just remind you right off the bat of Grand Theft Auto. However, this game is made by 2K Games, so it's not even it's not even made by Rockstar, so it's a totally different take on the game. And also, as you can see, this is set in the 1940s into the 1950s, meaning that the game itself is going to be quite a bit different than the new new world kind of uh, Grand Theft Auto feel and much different than the Red Dead Redemption feel. So you don't have to worry about the game being exactly the same because the time period is definitely different. However, many of the elements of Grand Theft Auto still stay. So as you can see here, the voice acting in this game is very similar to a lot of the Grand Theft Auto. The voice acting in this game is great, I'll just say that right off the bat. Even from the demo, you can just try that out uh, or see that it's just great. However, a lot of, like I said, a lot of the game elements from Grand Theft Auto are the same in Mafia 2. For instance, a lot of the game consists of running around, getting different missions, um, and it's just, the whole storyline is very similar. For example, the basic premises, without giving anything away, is that you're a guy named Louis Vito, who's, who just came over from Italy, is tr trying to find work, is caught up in the local mob, and is just set out to do all these tasks with the mob, trying to make a name for himself, earn some cash, live the American dream. So I've played this game both as a demo in the Xbox Live Arcade, and or the Xbox Live Marketplace rather, and I've played it at PAX East as well, which I attended earlier this year. And I will say that there's two different demos, so I've got to play more of this game than the average person. So that's why I've chosen, chosen to make this preview. So, for those of you who are wondering whether or not you should pre-order the game, I definitely recommend the pre-order to anybody who's really into the Grand Theft Auto series and just loves to play through those kind of games. As for myself, I, I mean, it's very, very similar, and considering I'm not a huge fan of the Grand Theft Auto series, it really doesn't catch my eye as something that I'm gonna pre-order. But definitely, I will say, if you're, if you're into the game, pre-order it, and make sure you check out Mafia2Game.com, because depending on the store that you live closest to, whether it be a Walmart, Best Buy, GameStop, or even Amazon.com, they all have different bonuses that you get when pre-ordering. So if you plan on getting the game, it would be worth the pre-order, and definitely if you're going to get the collector's edition, which is $15 or $20 more, it, it would probably be worth your while. So that's it for me, guys. Um, like I said, any, any lovers of the Grand Theft Auto series, um, definitely recommend this game. And be sure to play through the demo yourself, and of course be sure to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks guys.